go to Cone Field, second to last regular season game for the eighth ranked Panthers hosting Hamilton. It's the visiting Continentals who start us off. Honor Gabriel finishes the play by finding the back of the net, part of a three goal spurt. Tie game 9-9, Panthers counter with a spurt of their own. Georgia Carroll beats the keeper, Middlebury up 11-9 at recess, second half. Panthers in transition, Emma McDonough nets it to put Middlebury up by three. Then it's Kirsten Murphy takes it and creates it. Unassisted for the score, Panthers up by four and they weren't even close to done. Hollis Perticone from the free position, not stopping that one. Middlebury outscores Hamilton 9-2 in the second half, they take it by a final of 20 to 11. Right next door at Forbes Field, Middlebury Baseball taking on Bowden, game one of a Sunday doubleheader in the sun. Not a good start for the Panthers, however. Top first, man on second from Brendan O'Neill, who rips one through the right side. Polar Bears jump out in front, one nothing. Two batters later, Jack Wilhoyt smokes one up the middle, plates another run and the Panthers down by two. Colby Morris would settle down on the mound after those two early runs. He goes six and two thirds, three earned runs, four strikeouts. You just saw three of them there. Bottom second, Middlebury has the sacks packed with Panthers and Sebastian Sanchez at the plate. He comes through, ground ball right up the middle. Two runs come in to score. We have a tie ball game. The Panthers go on to sweep the doubleheader, five, four and three zip your finals.